Thanks for stopping by What's Up Deck. Uh, please like and subscribe for, subscribe for more content. Today we'll be showing you how to get uh, Xbox Game Pass games through the cloud. So first up, you want to open up in desktop mode, go to your Discover and into Applications. You'll go down to Internet, and you're going to be looking for the Microsoft Edge browser. Now, you will be playing it through the xCloud service through the web browser, which I believe will support almost around 340 titles in Game Pass, if you have Game Pass Ultimate. And so you want to install that Microsoft Edge. And once it's installed, you, what you're going to do is go up to Internet and right click on the Microsoft Edge icon. And then click Add to Steam. So that's going to pop up with uh, Microsoft Edge onto your Steam library. So let's transition over. Uh, well, first, you have to select the Microsoft Edge because you're adding it to your Steam library. So we're just going to scroll down, look for, there it is. Oh, right there. Microsoft Edge, select it, and click Add Selected Programs. So after you do that, it should pop up on the Steam. So now let's move over to, uh, actually, before we do that, forgot that we're going to go into the console. So see that console down towards the bottom? I'm going to select that. Now let's make this a little bit bigger so you guys can see the command line. Actually, let me just, let me just maximize it all. There we go. All right, and here's, I'm just going to skip ahead. This is going to be the command that you use. You hit enter to run that. And once that's done, now we're going to transition over to the Steam. Yeah, let's go over. Yep, cancel out of this and close out of that. Uh, yep, go to games, Steam. All right, once you're there, instead of X Cloud Gaming Beta, it's going to say, uh, it's going to say Microsoft Edge beta, I believe. So once you click on it and go or right click on it and then click properties, you should be able to change the name of it. So we're going over to properties. See right there where it says Xbox Cloud Gaming Beta. You should be able to just clear it and change the name, which I changed mine to Xbox Cloud Gaming Beta. You can do Xbox Game Pass or whatever you'd like. But uh, there's also this command line. I will be putting both the console command and this command line in the description. So if you want to copy that directly. Yeah. All right. But once you do that, you can go to manage your uh, right click on it, go to manage and then your controller layout here to set up to the correct layout. You can hit X to browse configurations and in the templates i believe the one where we'll be using is gamepad with touch screen um gamepad with mouse trackpad yep and after a second it'll say it just hit apply configuration and then hit done all right and once that's done you're going to go into properties and we're going to change the icon now you, I'm going to post the website for the instructions. It'll give you the full instructions as well as these icons that you can download. And you just select the Xbox Cloud Gaming icon there. And it'll change the icon on the left. And this, you can set the custom logo as well, the background. So right click on that and click set custom logo. And you can go back to where you you're, you saved your file and effectively choose the logo option. And last but not least, if you go to your full library, manage and change the custom artwork. And that one you can change to the, uh, I believe it's the banner. 
So I'm just playing it so that you guys can see Xbox Cloud Gaming. Hopefully this works pretty well for you. It works wonderfully for me. It actually works better than my PC for for the cloud gaming portion. <laughs> so um, yeah, please like, comment, uh, subscribe, and uh, let us know if you have any questions, any issues, but the ins full instructions should be listed in the description. All right, I wanted to thank you guys for checking out uh, What's Up Deck, and I hope you guys have a great day. Thank you.